I got this in uh, late last week. It's a uh, definitely a guitar I've been wanting for a long time. It is a Martin HD40 Tom Petty Signature Edition with a full moon fever theme. So these are really hard to come by. I only made 274 of them. Um, and after he passed away, I mean, you, you rarely saw him for sale while he was still alive, but after he passed away, the ones you did see for sale were very expensive. And I figured my opportunity to have a chance to own one uh, was, was very slim. Um, there's a store owner in Houston who had this one, and I offered him a trade on my old 1950 D28. And he said that's kind of what he was looking for. He's looking for a player's grade for the shop, basically a house guitar. And so we made the deal. Um, I shipped mine first. He shipped his second. UPS lost it. Uh, I wound up back to him. And he reshipped at FedEx and it finally got to me. But it was, uh, you know, it was a little stressful there for a while. Uh, and according to UPS, by the way... This guitar is still lost and they want me to file a claim. If I uh, if I wanted to be that way, I would file a claim, but since I have the guitar, that's all I wanted. Go over a few specifics on this guitar. First is a Italian Alpine Spruce Top. Beautiful. And I think it's got some type of aged toner on it. You got herringbone, because it's an HD. The H always stands for herringbone for Martin. It's got East Indian Rosewood, a really nice cut. And it's kind of hard to see with the, the reflection, but really nice cut of East Indian. And you got the 40 style back stripe, of course, going down. Um, ebony fingerboard, ebony bridge, 45 style pearl around the rosette. And on the sound hole sticker, I don't know if you can see it, but uh, there's Tom Petty's signature is in there. And of course they have the, uh, the etched one in pearl there. But the full moon fever is what it's themed after, and you can see the different stages of the moon. It's a full moon, then a sliver of a moon, quarter moon, half moon, then back to full moon again. Very cool. And it's got my favorite uh, headstock inlay, which is the uh, 45 style 1902. Uh, really nice tuners with ebony buttons. It is a 40 series Martin. Uh, this thing is not museum grade. Uh, a lot of these get, uh, after they're bought, they're bought by collectors and they just uh, never play them. This one's been played, which is good, um, but it's still in excellent condition. I mean, it's really good shape, but it comes in a tweed case. The tweed case is kind of dirty. That means it's been out and uh, this thing has been played for sure. Just have that big 40 series Martin sound in this Italian Alpine Spruce really resonates. Uh, just a great guitar. Huge sustain. So a long time waiting. I had a line on one about six years ago. Uh, deal did not go through. And then after Tom had passed away, the next one I saw was really expensive. And like I said, I just thought my opportunity to own one passed. But fortunately, this one is now 
in our possession and uh, these are so hard to come by that I doubt if I'm going to let this one go. Martin HD 40, Tom Petty, Full Moon Fever, Signature Edition.